Hello, I'm Larissa Tabariski, and today I'm going to show you how to prepare a spectacular Thanksgiving feast. Thanksgiving is probably the most challenging meal most of us cook during the year. There are so many side dishes and a huge turkey to deal with. And how do you cook the turkey? What is the right way? Do you brine it? Do you slow roast it and baste it and turn it every 20 minutes? Or do you cook it in a bag? If you are fortunate enough to own a Thermador convection oven, I recommend using the convection roast mode for roasting your turkey. Convection is the preferred cooking mode because convection heat is not drying, resulting in moist, juicy meat. Convection cooks faster. A 20 pound unstuffed turkey will be done in approximately two hours. There is no need to turn or baste the turkey. Circulating convection heat is perfect for baking all the side dishes at once, resulting in perfect timing. Today I'm going to show you how in two hours we can not only cook to perfection this 20 pound turkey, but also have all the side dishes ready at the right time. All it's going to take is a little knowledge of how to use the appliances. Organize the oven racks to accommodate the turkey and side dishes. Preheat the oven, selecting convection roast, 400 degrees. Season the turkey as per your recipe. Place the turkey on a rack in a shallow pan. If using a deep roasting pan, be sure to use a V-rack to allow for proper air circulation. For extra pan juices, add two to three cups of chicken stock to the pan. Insert the probe into the thickest part of the thigh making sure not to touch the bone. Insert the sensor into the oven probe receptacle and close the door. Touch the probe symbol and program to 160 degrees. Set the timer for 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, reduce the temperature to 350 degrees. The oven will turn off automatically when the probe temperature of 160 has been reached. The turkey is perfectly cooked if the skin around the leg has begun to retract. The leg moves loosely and the juices run clear when the meat is pierced. Check the internal temperature in several places with a digital thermometer. If you are preparing your Thanksgiving feast in a Thermador professional range, follow the same method and timing as we have just illustrated for the wall ovens. But check the internal temperature manually with a digital meat thermometer. For a 12 to 15 pound turkey, Check the internal temperature after one and three quarter hours. For a 15 to 20 pound turkey, check the internal temperature after two hours. For a 20 to 25 pound turkey, check the internal temperature after two and a half hours. Now one thing most people forget is how important it is to allow the turkey to really rest before carving. A large bird such as this will take about 20 minutes to rest and for the internal temperature to come up to the carving temperature, which is recommended at 180 degrees. So, give yourself that time. You're almost ready to eat. Now that the turkey is resting, this is the perfect time to cook all your side dishes. In addition to the 20 minutes that you'll need for the turkey to rest, 
you'll have to allow another 15 to 20 minutes for carving. That gives you 40 minutes for all your side dishes to cook to perfection. Remember, if you use convection, you can put multiple racks in, they'll cook evenly, and they'll be ready quickly. When cooking side dishes such as stuffing, roasted vegetables, choose convection 350. When baking pies, choose convection bake and the temperature recommended in your recipe. Making the gravy. Begin by preparing a giblet stock and set aside. Drain the cool turkey. Pick it up with two kitchen towels and let the juices drain into the pan. Pour the pan juices into a large measuring cup and skim off the fatty liquid that rises to the top. Make the roux, add the pan drippings, the giblet stock, and maybe a little flavoring such as Jack Daniels. Stir until thickened and check the seasoning before serving. Brining a turkey infuses it with delicate, subtle flavors, and when cooked in a traditional oven for a long period of time, prevents the meat from drying out. When cooking a brined turkey in your Thermador convection oven, select the roast mode and allow the turkey to cook for the normal cooking time, which will be three to five hours, depending on the size. Now that you know how simple it is to cook a splendid Thanksgiving meal in your Thermador convection oven, I hope that your Thanksgiving will be absolutely sensational. If you would like to have some more practical information on how to do your Thanksgiving feast, consider signing up for one of the classes that we hold in our showrooms. The schedule is on the culinary class section of the website. Thank you so much for joining us.